Morning everybody, Mike with Elite Reef here. I'm here at the shop early today so that I could shoot some time lapse and I wanted to show you what kind of a rig I'm using while I'm here. So enjoy. So this is the rig that I use to shoot time lapse. This shoots in full 6K resolution. So what I've got here is I've got a nice sturdy tripod. This holds the time lapse camera which today I'm running in Sony A77. Shoots amazing pictures. I've got that hooked up to a remote control. It allows me to time the shots, tell it how many shots, how far in between the shots, how long to open the shutter for each shot. So the settings I'm using for this one is ISO 50, aperture is at F18, and the shutter speed is 8 tenths of a second. I shoot really low ISO on these since it's being held by a tripod. I've also got the flow turned off on this flat so that it's not going to ripple the water or blur any of the shots or anything. That allows me to get the lowest noise possible, best image quality overall. And I've got that all shooting through in a vast marine portal, which gets past all the glare of the surface of the water. Gives me a nice crisp shot. And to mount that, I've got it on the GoPro section mount, which works amazingly just about anywhere. Just screws right into that Avast portal there as a standard tripod hole, luckily. So I'll probably be shooting probably 1,500 to 2,000 images of this A-can. Threw some food in the water right after lights came on to get some reaction out of this guy. And as I said before, I've got the flow shut off, get nice clean images. Once I get all those images, I'll process them through Lightroom as a batch of images. The way they all get the same settings, same crop, everything the same. And then I'll use Lightroom, or actually Photoshop, to turn that into a time-lapse video for you. Let's look forward to that being online. This should be a part of a video I've got coming up here. It'll be called Reef Lapse Part 2. A lot of really interesting time-lapses on there. So yeah, look for that coming out, and thanks for watching as always. Have a good one.